Hi, everybody. Ava Live RN, your favorite YouTube RN avatar. And I did not expect to be back in this clinic so quickly with this young lady. But Chantel seems to have released a particularly interesting animation called Dipping Sauce Negligence. And I thought we could just, you know, watch this in a safe space together and uh, see what's going on in the mind of Miss Chantel. And so if you do like this type of content, I would always say, you know, subscribe, like, make a comment. We love that here. And before we get started in any of our disclaimers, always love to read a little phrase of the day. And today, act as if what you do makes a difference. It does. And that's coming from our friend, Mr. William James. Thank you, Mr. James. We'll remember that. So just to let you know that anything that we do watch here is in fair use. And uh, just always want to point that out. Another thing here is that obviously we might have a little bit of fun here. Even though I am a licensed registered nurse here in the United States, this is just my opinion. It's commentary. There might be a little bit of roasting, a little bit of ranting. But we try not to be too negative here. We try to be a little bit, a little bit kinder here and have some real discussions about medical concerns and medical topics. So if you do like that type of content, just check out some of the other videos here. But I think she's waiting to come on. She's 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 eager. Let's add her to our sage, our friend, Miss Chantel. And let's just kind of dive in and see what we got here today. Um, I am not a mental health nurse, and so I don't know um, what to think out about this video, but it certainly is interesting. The title, at least. Hello, foodie beauties. <laughs> Hello! Welcome to Prince Albert Burger. Can I tell you about our daily specials? I need to speak to your manager. Oh, okay, ma'am, sure. But can I tell the manager what the problem is? Yeah, so I was just at your drive through location on Splinter Drive, and I ordered the Prince Albert Burger with onion rings instead of fries and two zingy sauces. So, I came home, smelling those onion rings all the way, got comfy, put on Jerry Springer, mouth watering, I grabbed my hot fresh burger, spread out the wrapper, dumped the onion rings, and pushed them aside because I like to put the little cup of zingy sauce beside the rings to dip, and to my absolute horror, there was none in the bag. Prince Albert burger, onion rings napkin and straw now i know the bag felt a bit lighter than usual but i thought nah okay i'm not too sure i have a lot of questions and i have a lot of concerns <laughs> you know that uh, i don't know if prince albert burger is a actual chain in Canada, since that is, I believe, a state in Canada or an area in Canada. Sorry, sorry for my Canadian geography ignorance. You can put comments down below. Uh, I should have probably looked that up first, hey, but I, this is fresh to me. Uh, the onion rings, I think she is a fan of onion rings and everything looks pretty brown. So that goes in line with foodie's diet. I don't know if she's ordering these things or is she potentially projecting what she wants to be ordering into this cartoon i'm not too sure um are zingy sauces actual sauces in canada and i'm not familiar with it uh she mentioned she has napkins which i have seen in the past that uh chantelle is often without napkins and she uses any type of clothing item or whatever is nearby as a source of napkin. And uh, my last question is, 
is the person on the phone supposed to be Chantel's alter ego? I'm just I'm just asking because I'm really really not sure what this is supposed to be at this point. Um, other than the fact that she obviously cannot make content showing her going out to eat any of this stuff since most of the content is around eating. Um, but anyway, yes, only true. Let's continue. Surely they wouldn't forget my sauce. I mean, you do realize that the only thing that makes those rings of grease enjoyable is the sauce, right? I mean, I simply find them inedible unless they're covered in zingy sauce. So this is an emergency and a major inconvenience. I'm Unfortunately, that is true. If you observed and Chantel in the clinic I think that we need to talk about the types of portion sizing for the sauces why two singing sauces why so much dressing on the salad why so much cheese these are just the questions we may portion moderation is what we need to start working on but anyway let's go back to this very strange that Miss Chantel's made. I missed half of my Jerry Springer already, and it's a good one too. Tonight it's about a woman about to find out her new lover is really a manatee, and I can't miss it. But I can't enjoy that show without junk food, and I can't enjoy your onion rings without zingy sauce. So please get the manager. The show is almost over. They don't have to try and find something else stupid to watch at this hour. And the only thing on besides Jerry are those stupid YouTube reaction channels discussing that large woman in Canada. Ooh. Is that a slip that, that you're back in Canada? I thought you were in Kuwait. Not in Kuwait anymore? You're in Canada? Are you still traveling and trying to obtain a DVT? I'm a little bit confused. Who is the character? I am asking if that is her alter ego and the way that we view her because we've all been saying that she sits around and watches reaction channels all day. I'm I'm really not sure and uh, didn't know Jerry Springer was around anymore. I'm still I still I have a lot of questions. But it Ooh, all right, ma'am. I'll see if the manager is available now. One moment, please. <laughs> Little Bill, honey, I have something to tell you, honey. Well, what is it, Charles? I'm not really a human man. <gasps> what do you mean, Charles? I mean, I'm a man. Oh, honey, I'm all man. But I'm not a human I'm an aquatic mammal. Oh. Hello, ma'am. Thank you for waiting. So, I'm so sorry, but the manager's not available now. You will have to fill out the online form for customer complaints. Would you like the World Wide Web address, ma'am? Well, I'm not sure what the reference of a manatee is. Has anybody ever heard her mention manatees before? I just, I'm very confused of what's trying to be expressed in this particular animation that we're watching. Is this going to be a new character that Chantel is interesting, uh, introducing to her audience? Anyway, let's continue. <laughs> no, no, no. I just missed the best part of my show. Only to be told that a manager cannot help me now? I thought your policy was that there's always a manager on site. Well, yes, ma'am, there's a manager on site, but... But what? Where are they then? Well, ma'am, our manager's busy, you see, dealing with the police due to a customer pulling a missile launcher on our burger team for forgetting their chicken nuggy sauce. You see? One day, this sauce negligence is going to cause a mass destruction. Smarten up, people. Wake up. Anyway, 
My problem is serious too, but I'm willing to be patient only because weapons of mass destruction were involved, making the manager unavailable. What is the web address? I'll complain online. Let's go. Sure, ma'am. It's, uh, all right. I just, I just, is this something that Chantel has experienced in the past? Have you had times when you feel irritated that a person in a restaurant or some type of, you know, fast food establishment has not remembered to give you your sauce? I'm just, I'm just wondering if this is a projection. Is this a story that happened to you and you're just fictionalizing it in this uh, little film here? Anyway. All right, let's continue. I think it's almost done. A little disturbed. HTTPS www.princealbertburger backslash we don't give a crap dot com. It's nothing personal. We just find edginess in marketing brings in more of our target audience. Okay, whatever. Anyway. Now, who is that meant to be a comment toward? about Chantel and the type of content that she creates and whether her content is edgy. Not sure that's how people see it. Not sure. Seeing a lot of things that uh, maybe should be expressed with the help of a licensed professional individual rather than your audience seeing all of this out here. I think there's a lot of rage and anger. I think that. Uh, yeah. All right. Let's see if we can continue. About a minute to go of that. Anyway, this is our safe place. I guess I'll microwave some cheese until this gets sorted out. I'm highly disappointed. You do better. Okay, man, we will. Thanks for being a loyal Prince Albert Burger customer. I hope you get the missing sauce justice you are seeking. And by the way, Lula Bell ends up giving Charles a chance. Isn't that lovely? Have a great day. Thank you for shopping at Prince Albert Burger. Okay, everybody. I'm not sure quite what to make of that little film that Miss Chantel released today. I guess it's new creative content from her bed. Written, written era here, the bed, bed bound arc, whatever we're calling it over here. I am a little, um, I have questions, obviously, um, about the chosen topics in that she's still raging at the reaction channels. And as a medical professional, I would always, you know, hope that she does have opportunities to speak to somebody about any of the things that are concerning her or that she may need to find better ways to have healthier outlets for these concerns. But anyway, I am not her practitioner. I am not giving her any medical advice. And this is just solely for entertainment purposes only. But anyway, if you do like how these little fun things are done, please hit the likes. Subscribe, subscribe, you know, all the good stuff. Anyway, I'm going to bring on my theme song and uh, we'll see you later on. Bye.